Hello and welcome back to the channel. I'm your host and Stallone of Staccato, Ken Levine. I'm a singer and vocal coach here on YouTube. And today we are looking at Beth Hart. This is another suggestion from one of our dear viewers and subscribers. Uh, Maurice writes in, Beth Hart, if you haven't heard her sing, is an American blues singer who wears her heart on her sleeve and puts all of herself into her performances. And Maurice left me a few links here, and we're just gonna click on the first one and get that up and running here. And so we can watch Beth Hart sing, Am I the One? Oh, Hi. Uh, how you doing? <laughs> That's Beth Hart there. I wanna come closer. Kind of a Woody Woodpecker oh. kind of laugh. <laughs> like this is one of the few places like where it's okay to be totally insane it's okay right because it's just entertainment you know it's not like a big deal you know i want to sing some blues man yeah do you think it'd be okay if we just kind of all sat down what aren't what? your feet tired what is she doing you know? give your feet a rest just relax, smoke a joint, <laughs> do whatever you do. Yeah, man. Whoa. I really like Holland a lot, man. <laughs> you guys are bitching. <laughs> oh, it's so much nicer. This way we get to just relax, kick our feet up, be together, you know? Hey, you guys, I want to tell you sincerely, man, Thank you so much for being here tonight for us. Mm. I really appreciate it. Mm. I fucking mm. so appreciate it. That's sincere right there. I, you have to have an incredible level of comfort with your audience and a lot of trust with the people that are there. Get down from that stage and sort of level the playing field, as it were. So much of that energy and that crowd dynamic is based on that what do you call it unwritten social contract all, all of the chairs are faced in the same direction you are the audience i will perform for you after i'm done you will clap and to sort of break down that particular social contract and sort of change everything up without warning it shows a lot of faith in yourself and ability as a performer but also uh, faith in your audience that this is not gonna go sideways god bless you yeah go ahead boys <laughs> mm. I don't know Beth Hart at all, but I have a feeling we're going to get to know her real well after the end of this song. Vibrato there. <laughs> A little scat to start out her blues riff. Bring it on down now. I sing these words time and time again to express my life. Being your lover and your friend And as the clouds Clack, clack, clack High above They gon' shed their tear, baby I'm gonna embrace you, baby mm, She's channeling something here With love From all your fear But am I the one Whoa, yeah <laughs> Oh 
gosh, you know, to be in the audience, like to be that close, like six inches a foot away from that kind of energy that's just pouring out in front of you, intimidating, scary, amazing, something you don't experience that often. And she's just channeling all that energy, man. That is, like I said, scary and intimidating for the audience. I've often had this experience where I'm up on stage and I'm singing and I'm, <laughs> I ain't channeling that kind of energy. You know what I'm saying? It's a different kind of energy. And you, you single someone out in the audience and they kind of recoil, you know, they're like, oh, wait a second. I thought I was part of this group and I was anonymous, but you see me, you see me. And for some people in the audience, if they're like introverts, they just don't like that. It's an uncomfortable feeling. I have a feeling that the, the folks here in Amsterdam are a little bit more loose. If you, if you are pushing your way up to the front of the stage, you love that energy and you feed off of it. Yeah, you gon' flow to your fingertip, motherfucker. <laughs> and I pray for the day. Mm -hmm. I hear those fashion swirls fast to your lips. And we're shin upon a star from up above. That, that soon you, you look at me, baby. Whoa. And say, Chill, baby. Just tell me you love me, baby. If I hear it's a lie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Man, that whole Janis Joplin-esque riff through that was intense. I, I got chills there. Hair on the back of my arms, standing up on end. That's something special for sure. Maurice. <laughs> down next to mama <laughs> I'll make you feel good I'll make you feel all right hey play, play. she will and must be obeyed that is a front woman right there It's like a religious experience, you know? I gotta turn this up. Guitar solo. Yeah.
That was as much a duet as Thank a solo. Thank you so much, you guys. God bless you. Uh, that's it? Is that the end of the show? I guess that, that is as good as encore as ever, as you'd ever see. A great time, man. Thank you. Ah, right on. I guess that was it. Beth Hart Band. All right. John Nichols on guitar. Uh <sighs> extraordinary whoa blues power that's what that is right there that's it in a nutshell what do you what how do you talk about the blues man ah uh, it's it's an energy source you tap that you could power a small city a large city for several weeks seen performers technically proficient beautiful wonderful performers everything's just so needs to be does the job everything but you kind of get the feeling that maybe that performer was is a uh, dead from the waist down or they're they're cutting that part of themselves off from their performance not bad heart what you see is what you get and you're gonna get the whole deal right in front of you well that performance will Definitely leave an effect in the comments section. Leave your comments down below and let me know your thoughts. What did you think of that voice? What did you think of that performance? Was it something special? Did it move you? Did it take you to a different place? Or did it leave you cold? I'm, I'm interested. I don't want to know how, how you felt. Obviously, it had an effect on me and probably a residual effect for many hours afterwards. But uh, let me know your thoughts and, and be sure to drop a comment and perhaps leave a timestamp. Let me know what, what stood out for you, what moment in that particular performance stood out for you. So if you are not yet a member of this fabulous community, hey, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the great stuff that we produce here every week on the channel. And if you have made it to the end of this glorious video, hey, thank you very much, you saucy meatballs, you, for taking time out of your busy day and joining us. You are majestic, beautiful beings, and I truly, truly thank you. Huge love and thanks to you all, and we will see you next time.